Welcome aboard. Whenever you see the pause button, press pause on your video and say your answer out loud. All right, let's get started. Welcome to Light the Music class, session one. I'm Steve Van Dam with Light the Music, and my students like to call me Mr. Steve, so if that works for you, let's go. In these classes, we're going to learn more music, and most importantly, we're going to make more music. So if you're a student, a parent, a teacher, anyone, if you want to make and learn music, this class is for you. I've taught a lot of music classes in person, but I haven't done a lot of videos. The great thing about a video is that you can skip ahead or you can jump back if you want to see something again. Or if I go like this, you can press pause and try and answer the question before I give you the answer. Make sense? All right, let's jump into it. What do you need to get started? You will need an iOS device, an iPad is awesome, but an iPhone, any iOS device, that's good. What's better is a set of headphones or earbuds. What's best is a speaker like this. You can even plug your iPhone or iPad into a TV and have a concert. So there's all kinds of crazy things that you can do to make this really exciting. You might want to see if you've got one of these laying around or ask your parents to order one of these. This is called a Y cable and it plugs into the headphone and turns it into two headphones. So you can share music making with your mom, your brother, uh, whoever else. Let's get started. First thing we have to do is we have to download the Oro app. If you need someone's help with this, just press pause until they're ready. All right, ready to go? Now we're gonna go to the App Store with your device and type in Oro Visual Music. O-R-O -O, Visual Music. See that green circle? Yep, that's the one. Now there's a couple other Oro apps up there. We don't need to worry about them yet. Just get the Oro Visual Music one for now. Once that's downloaded, then we'll be ready to go. So press pause, and then as soon as it's ready, open it up and let's go. Okay, ready to go? You should see this on your iPad or iPhone. The first question is, what is music? Press pause if you've got some answers. Okay, what we talk about in this class is that music is sound organized into rhythm and pitch. So rhythm is patterns of sounds over time and pitch, you know, ah, ah. pitch can also be organized into melody, which is individual pitches over time, or harmony, which is pitches all stacked up on top of each other. Now that we've got some musical terms, let's get into music making. So for instance, we could say, ooh, I really like that rhythm. So what the app is gonna do is it's gonna repeat everything when that loop button is on. And this is how we're gonna make music. Let's start with rhythm. Rhythm's a great structure to build on. So all of these instruments at the top here, whichever one you have selected, when you touch the screen, there's different places where you can touch that do different sounds and visuals. And away you go, right? So I'm gonna get a quick rhythm going here. Now once I can feel that rhythm, and kind of move my head to it, now I'm ready for melody. So I'm gonna pick one of these instruments, like the earth, and I'm gonna go low to high, pitches low to high. Now I've got a melody. I can even put in chords like this. I can even add bass with this star looking instrument. Now you see the instruments 
that I've selected are bright, but all the others are, are dark now. And that's because I've used six instruments. We'll talk more about that in the next session. But for now, what I want you to do is just explore, try stuff out, mess around with all these buttons and see what you can make. All right? Coming up next in session two is how to create. Thanks for joining us in my music class. We'll see you next time. You made it to the end. Now, for the next five to 10 minutes, play with the instruments, make a loop that you like, and then share it on Flipgrid. Sharing tips come up next. Sharing option A is screen record. Make an Oro, use your device to screen record it, and then upload it to Flipgrid. Option B sharing is make an Oro and rehearse what you want to record. Have someone else use a second device to record this video and then upload that video to Flipgrid. Have fun.